So to uh, load the uh, route into uh, Strava, <clears throat> this is what you do. So basically uh, you get the GPX file from your friend. It's only the uh, uh, free accounts you need to do this. The paid account can just do it directly. So once you get the GPX file, go to your Strava and uh, click on the uh, upload activity. And you see all of these, I just uh, ignore them. Just go uh, file and go choose file. Pick the file that, uh, that was given to you, go open. And uh, all these uh, right, right type, uh, title, uh, you don't have to really worry about it. Just put this, just so I can identify the uh, route and description. And bike, all these you can kind of ignore, but the most important part is choose uh, only you because these are not the actual right. If you post everyone, it will post as a right. And you're done before you get to start getting all the cool balls, all the you know, comments for the right that you didn't do. So uh, just make sure you choose only you and go save and view. Okay, so once you have that right, so we, we got here, there's a, there's a right. And what you do is you click on here and go create a route. And give it a name. And this one, uh, just mountain bike. And go save to my route. Okay. Then if you go to uh, dashboard, my route, you'll see it's right here. That's it for the Strava part, and I'll show you the Garmin part here. And on the uh, bike computer, if you choose IQ, and if you have the Strava already synced, just choose Strava route. It will pull the real-time data on what's on your Strava. Let's wait a little bit. Okay, this is the one that we just did. So if you click on it. And if you go navigate M route, it will start downloading uh, the route itself. Okay, just give it a little bit of time to uh, download the route. And uh, uh, I guess it's the mountain. Okay, and once that's done, you see the screen, that means it's already been downloaded. You don't have to write it. Just go, go to the home screen, and then what you're gonna do is to check to see if it's offline. It's in the computer, so you don't have to worry about internet connection. So just go navigate and choose course, and go save to course. You see these two? This one is live. It requires internet connection, and this one is uh, downloaded to your computer, uh, to the uh, uh, Garmin. So just use that one, right? And just choose right. And that, that, that should do it. That's it.